my friends so you have a course you created a course you put it online and now you want to get more sales using a chatbot so did you know that you can add a chatbot to your sales page and offer them a coupon on exit or maybe offer them a coupon just by them chatting and asking questions you can actually have an interactive conversation with your visitor with a person that's on the page that will get them to engage and maybe you ask them questions and maybe you direct them to a different place depending but you can have whatever conversation you want on autopilot using a chatbot now what we're going to talk about today is we're going to talk about adding a coupon to your course and then offering that coupon if they exit the page like for example let's just show you right here if I just go uh, actually I gotta go share the screen first uh if I just go to this uh, page over here well let's get my little fella out of the way here and what is this is not right oh I must have moved my <laughs> there we go there we go okay sorry about that so yeah so if you've got a page like this you got a course right there's they're on the on the sales page and they're like oh my god that's 150 bucks that's too much for me and then they just go over here and they're going to go and exit and look at that oh it's a pops up hey wait 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 don't don't go away don't go away can I sweeten the deal for you and this is a chat bot that's going to be popping up on the screen and all you got to do uh they do is they say yeah sure what's the deal and then you tell them what if I could offer it to you at 75 bucks but and then it goes on and whatever you want the chatbot to say you can do that right so we're going to get into that and how to do that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets. So you've got a course and you want to sell uh, you want to sell it obviously you want to increase the sales and you you actually can offer it at a lower price using chatbots and make it more interactive and have more engagement and people will like that and feel that you care about them right because you're asking them questions um even though it's automated it's certainly not as good as a human talking to them and having conversations but you know you don't you don't have time to talk to every single person that lands on your course page right you want to at least seem in uh the person that they're in they're talking to and that's kind of how you do it so before we get into that don't forget if you're listening to the audio of this uh, you're going to want to go cis 313.jsgagnon.com to go check out the video and the blog post because I will be sharing my screen and I'll be showing you how this all works so first let's let's back up a little bit you have a course maybe you've hosted it on uh, there's a whole bunch of different platforms out there obviously I can't cover the different platforms I can only show you how I've done it the platform I use is Click eCourse so you have um you need to get the course on there to follow along here it's it's a platform where you can host up to two courses for free so you can just do it for free um yourself so just all you got to do is you go to the site you click on the register a link that's right there and you're going to be able to register you're going to click on continue with Facebook or use email and password I'm going to create a new account right now for this episode just to test so I'm just going to put an email address here which is basically the same uh, as the episode so 313 and we're going to just put this here like that with the password test password I'm just going to click on register so that allows me to register it'll send me an email to there and that's and then I got to activate so let's just go <laughs> check that email right now and let's just look at these emails just reload the page there you go account activation so you're going to get an email like that it's just going to say account activation on click eCourse you just have to click on this activation link I'm going to open that in the incognito window because I want it to be on that so we open it there and now I'm activated my account's activated so I can click I can just click on that check mark so now I have an account right as you can see up here there's no profile picture just a person but what you can do is you just click on the plus here you create your course and you uh, give it a course title so this is awesome LinkedIn secrets so let's just call it let's just say LinkedIn secrets so uh, learn how to use LinkedIn 
to grow <coughs> your business right so in this course in this course you will learn everything you need to know about LinkedIn to use it to grow grow your business now obviously obviously I'm not going to talk about uh the, the the content and the details everything you got to put but these are basic the basics of the course that you're creating whatever course you have you if you have it already someplace else you can always probably just cut and paste some some parts of that course to just host it here and uh, you can click on next or you can go straight to the different uh, items up here so header code we're going to need that in a bit but for now let's just uh, let's just just maybe put a cover image uh let's see I think I have I think I have the LinkedIn course up in here my LinkedIn course LinkedIn secrets uh LinkedIn profile secrets connection growth business growth uh LinkedIn what are these Dan Loke well these were just images I took of him accepting profile view I'm just going to put that like this one okay so this will be I'm just going to say done for now we're not going to I'm not going to worry about uh, saving it but let's just say this is my LinkedIn secrets course it shows a LinkedIn graphic obviously uh, having a proper graphic a really nice is definitely better um, so now I just have to add lessons to it so the lessons is basically the same thing you just go in here and I can put in a shareable link if I go to my YouTube for example and I search for my search for LinkedIn I'm just going to look up of the course the LinkedIn um, LinkedIn videos I have here so these are course income ones LinkedIn secrets video one so let's just use this one here I'm just going to get this it, these aren't even mine these are this this is a, a PLR course but I'm just going to do this get shareable link over here I'm going to paste that back in here and I'm going to make this uh, publish right away save that so that's adding one lesson number one um the title summary and details will be taken from shared link I might want to edit that see right now it just says LinkedIn success video one let's add another one we're going to add the second one over here video two get shareable link paste that over here I'm going to publish it right away as well save that anyways publishing is uh it's not uh, it doesn't matter right now because we're not making this well we probably should but okay let's just add another one let's add three of them so we at least have three get shareable link and let's just so we're creating a course in the platform click eCourse because I need to show you in that platform how to add a chatbot to your course right so and uh, might as well put video number four in here video four and do we I guess that's it one two three four oh there's and then there's more here there's six seven eight nine ten there's video five LinkedIn success get shareable link add another one it'll be nice uh there might you know it, there's things to improve obviously on the platform but uh, for now that's kind of how you do it you just create the the course with the lessons and if we just leave it at five right now if I go back to the course you just click on the course link at the bottom here you're going to see the, the the lessons are all here well these lessons that we did right LinkedIn success video one two three four obviously you want to edit these so if I want to say what is this uh, edit this what is this this is introduction introduction um so LinkedIn success in let's what what is this course about and what will you learn by the end by the by the end of it all right so <laughs> so I can add details in here too um uh let's actually put that in the details and then over here I'm just going to say what is this course about and there you go and then I'm just going to leave that for that like this but see what happens now is if I go to the course and I actually play this now you can see that it says what is this course about introduction instead of saying video one two three right I actually added a uh, what's this course about I can actually go play this video right now and it'll show me the intro thing here uh, but after and then uh, let's just pause that 
and then I can click on the more up here you can see the description that we put in if you wanted a more description you can of course um, add more but that's basically that's the basics of if I go back to course here that's the basics of creating a course now the other thing you want to have it's not a free course I don't want this to be a free course there's no point in having a chatbot on well I'd be I guess you could still use a chatbot to capture emails and things like that but let's just say we want to uh we want to um sell this course and give a coupon right so let's just do that we're going to edit the course there's edit right here or there right so we're just going to edit the course and we're going to go to the price commission and we're going to give we're going to sell this for 500 right whatever um and then I'm going to give a commission I'm actually going to give 90 percent commission to anybody who promotes this course I'm going to make it any even a free a free user can have the commission so I'm just going to say done now the course is 500 dollars right maybe I make it 499 let's make it 499 price make it 497 there you go that looks night better right 497 the course is 497 and if somebody gets to this I'm actually gonna have to publish the course let's publish the course oh actually yeah that's the other thing if you go to edit uh there's a access right here you want to make sure that the course is accessible otherwise nobody's going to be able to buy it so I can make it um an unlisted course if I want that means that somebody has to have the link to get it which might be okay maybe you're going to create a funnel and you're going to send people to your course directly without them being able to find it um and uh but I'm going to make it public mm, should I no let's make it unlisted just because I don't want this is not a course that's real I'm kind of putting it together for this this episode so let's just make it unlisted I'm just going to set it unlisted I'm going to say done and uh, now it's unlisted right it's course is hidden and only available by link above right so this link here uh well you can't see the link but this link here up here right this uh, this is a link to your course the link is going to be based on your uh, it's going to be based on your uh, course name so LinkedIn secrets right is the name of the course so that actually goes in the link that allows SEO to work better um, whenever you're sharing that in, in ads or anything like that right so that's one of the reasons why you want to put a title that is specific to the course right so LinkedIn secrets use um, okay so that's that's uh, the course now we have the course created now let's add a chatbot to it so how do we add a chatbot so you need chatbot software uh there's I'm sure tons of different ones I use a myconvergialbot.com let's go to it here so this is the the one I use <coughs> so I've got a folder here. let's just uh well first you got to get the chatbot software how do you get the chatbot software oh and <laughs> you know what before we get into that how do you get to this link right where, where do you get this course set up how do you this is click ecourse so let's put the link on here uh click ecourse this is this is how you get to it click ecourse.com so you can go on there and like I said you click on the register to register an account then you can you can you can host at least up to two courses for free they have to be videos that are on YouTube you can't uh, upload your own videos with the free account but still you upload it to YouTube and then you put the link in there and then it lets you create a course with these you know with the uh, with us uh, well there's some limits to number of lessons whatever but you can do a uh, pretty much any and a useful course uh for free right so that's uh where you go you go to clickycourse.com that's how you get the course as set up on the site that's the site the next thing you need is a chatbot software so the chatbot software that I use is called my conversion is called my and um you can actually if you actually oh you know what if you go to click ecourse you're going to see this little fella down the bottom here you just click on him and you're going to get the link to my conversion bot right here so just click on that <coughs> and that'll open up the page where you get information from the actual uh do I have it in here cool chat chat bot link yeah so you'll actually go to that link or info.myconvergialbot.com and that's basically where you can get it now right now they have a special deal a lifetime deal I don't know when how long it's going to last because they're actually starting to they're starting to promote the next version which includes Facebook and is going to include WhatsApp for now this is a website uh, or blog chatbot and it's a lifetime deal right so I don't know how long this lifetime deal, deal is going to last 
uh you probably should check it's ridiculous 37 dollars. It's, it's not even worth talking about it's and maybe you can get it for less see right there there's a 10 percent coupon and just a little tip if you click on the if you click on right here Carly the little the little person down the bottom here if you click on her she's actually going to give you even a better deal and <laughs> and if you try to exit the page if you go up here it pops up this thing that's going to give you even a better deal so just you know do that you can get I don't know how much it is or maybe the deal is going to be gone when you check it but like I said the one-time deal expires soon so go get that but that's the bot I use all right so that's the bot uh let's uh, go and remove that from there okay so that's the chatbot so now what what I do is I go into the chatbot software let's go over here so let's go here I'm just going to so first I create three bots right three chatbots but you could probably have four all right um the on exit I actually don't really care about having a non exit for students because I don't want to bug them more than they have they, they have to be but I definitely don't want to bug students about buying the course they've they've already got the course why would why would I bug them with it right so if I have so if I have a main chatbot so if I go to say for example this LinkedIn course that I have there's a main chatbot right here that chatbot there is <coughs> you know says welcome to the LinkedIn course and I maybe I can ask them questions about link, what they're looking for for LinkedIn I actually haven't uh, finish this and maybe I should work on it right now but um I'm just gonna kind of tell you so there's that chat bot then there's an on exit one if I mouse over oh I guess I gotta reload the page if I mouse over if I mouse away I've got an on exit one right it says oh don't leave what if I give you a deal right so obviously this is this should not be showing up for me because I'm the creator of this course but anyways that's not a big deal I can just close it but for somebody who's visiting the site who doesn't know this course is 150 bucks right let's uh and then I give them a coupon so let's actually let's talk about let's see let's talk about the 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 chatbot first first let's create three chatbots for this new course I just ho I just created right so I got the new course which is right over here where is it over here over here I've got this new course right this um LinkedIn secrets course right and by default it's the click ecourse site bot right well I want to have my own bot on this on this site right so let's create a bot for this site so I'm going to go in here I'm going to create a new a new bot uh, build a bot I'm going to give it a new folder it's going to be uh cis313 LinkedIn tests right and it's going to be called um um, um 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 default default visitor well de just default let's make it default let's call it default so I'm going to put it in a new folder I'm going to create it and then what it does it loads up the the builder so over here we're just going to put one block just to kind of show you how it works because you can do lots of different things so I'm going to just put the new block here I'm going to say welcome welcome to oh this is just going to say welcome and then over here I'm going to say welcome to LinkedIn link LinkedIn secrets all right then I'm going to just add something I'm going to say I'm going to say do you let's chat let's chat so then I'm going to add user response I'm going to say uh buttons and I'm going to say sure and then I'm going to say legal consent and it's going to be uh let's go over here I've got the privacy legal let's just do the legal copy link address put that in, in here there you go continue all right so let's continue there I'm going to save that so now I have a first message let's add another block let's add another block and I'm going to say um <clears throat> get name I'm going to say great great my name is you know Serge what's your name what's your name okay I'm going to add the user response right here I'm going to say uh, it's text and it's going to be their first name 
and just uh, capitalize each word and validation yes continue <coughs> okay so now I've got the I'm asking their name I can connect these two together like that actually I'm going to move my video again to the bottom there we go okay so I'm going to get their name and then whoops then I can say um add block and I'm going to say over here I'm going to say nice nice well actually uh what can I help with okay so I'm going to say great meeting you and then I'm going to add the person's name use placeholder right here it's going to be first name copy that and I'm going to paste that right here and I'm actually going to add a little little smiley face I'm going to put uh let's just say this little I don't know this just this regular smiley face I'm not sure which one let's put that one okay and then I'm going to add what can I help you with right so let's just use a response I'm going to say buttons I'm going to say uh getting profile set up all right I'm going to add whoops plus I'm going to add um finding new connections and I'm going to say getting sales from connections all right and then let's just put another one talk to human all right so I'm going to say continue right here save that so now I have three questions I'm asking them got to connect this to here so there's three questions I'm asking them so let's actually move that over to here because we don't whoops can't close that and then I'm going to go like this so I'm going to ask them you know what can I help you with LinkedIn right and then uh, then we're not going to finish this but I could have four different flows and have different answer different um things I could send them to to maybe my blog post I could you know and whatever and things like that and then of course I can offer them the course right I'm going to say hey this course is 500 dollars or 497 uh what if I what would you like a coupon to save 25 percent on the course or something right so I can do that so now I can just say launch and I'm gonna um I don't need anything well actually the design let's talk about the design if I go to the design here I actually want to change the bot to be my face instead of being this little fellow right well actually let's first before we do that let's just show you how to add it to the course so first if I go to publish right here I can get the bot code right here this is the bot code I just want this bot code and you go to clicky course uh where we're we? right here and I'm going to edit this course and I'm going to say I want in the header code I want the bot code to be this one as you can see there's a student one here too right so I'm going to just say done and when I reload this page now now you see down the bottom look at that this little fella is right whoops actually behind my you see this is the one that's showing up now right what if I it says right here welcome to it doesn't say anymore welcome to Click eCourse it says welcome to LinkedIn secrets right so now I want him to be on the other side he's not on the right side so let's go back to here I want to go back here I want to say uh that's and that's in the bot design right it's in the design I want it to be on the left hand side instead of the right so uh where is it under is it bot design yeah right here okay bot design I just say left and now it's going to be on the other side of the page and um, I want to say um what if I say over here I say linked in question like this right LinkedIn question right and then the secondarily is going to be continue conversation okay and then I want to have I don't know two of these <laughs> instead of one and I want to also change now let's just save that and launch it if I go back to my uh to my course here if I reload it you can see now it's going to be moved to the other side right so now it's moved down here LinkedIn question it says right uh well, let's say I want to have my face there so then what I do is I go into the bot icon after and preload I add 
my image I'm actually going to put a gallery I don't have to upload it I already have it I'm actually going to put this image I have of me pointing right this one here uh continue there so that's going to be the image pointing to the question and over here I'm going to put my normal image which is just uh, this one here all right and I'm going to save that and I'm going to launch it again so now if I reload the, the chatbot page or the course page I should say now we have my picture down here and it's, it'll say LinkedIn question and I'm going to click on it and it's going to load up the welcome to LinkedIn and um, it's going to say let's chat and then I'm going to say sure and, and great my name is Jean-Serge what's your name it's Bob and then it's going to say nice meeting you Bob and then it's going to say what can I help you with right these questions right so now we didn't complete that chat the chat whole you know sequence of things but <laughs> that's kind of get you started now what if they you want an exit bot so now you got to have an exit bot so let's do let's go back to the bots actually my bots website bots and I want to go to let's go to my folder here which is the new one this this one here and this is the default let's create a new bot um build a bot it's going to be inside of this folder right here it's going to be called default exit right I'm just going to call it default exit you can call it whatever you want but so this is going to be a non-exit bot so now first it's the same thing it's going to be a first block that's going to say wait you know I always like to say the wait right so I'm going to say new block I'm going to say actually I'm going to add image an image first it's going to make it an image uh gallery I actually have this uh, this this weight guy right here right I just do that and let's make this no delay whoops no delay <clears throat> right away make it zero you can actually put a zero there and that means it show up as fast as it can I'm going to add another text right here it's going to wait don't don't go just yet <laughs> is it the price of the course that's stopping me from getting it well actually I should say don't let's just say anyways don't don't you want this course and let's make this zero as well because I want it to show up at the same time as that and then I'm going to say user response it's going to be buttons and it's going to be um, don't you want this course I I want it but it's too much and then I want to say I I already have it I already have it I'm going to say doesn't look like uh, well let's not worry let's not worry about it let's just say we just have those two options and I'm going to say continue and I'm going to save that so now that now I have this wait 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 don't go right and let's just say whoops I say don't go right I got that like this save that okay so now I have the wait don't go of course we're gonna um like here's the thing over here I'm gonna say um yes to uh, give deal so okay okay what if I gave it to you at 75 percent off and then I'm going to put another user response I'm going to say uh, buttons again I'm going to say wow yes please yes please I'm going to say I'm just going to put that I don't worry about saying no right so this is the this one here was a price wasn't it don't you just don't you want this course is it the price of the course that's stopping you from getting it okay give a deal and then I'm going to say this is going to be already have it have it a 
have a great day now I could always ask them a question or do other things but let's just do that like that and then this is just going to be like this and give the deal and then over here is going to be uh all right okay so close offer deal I should say offer offer deal right then I'm going to go in here I'm going to say add another block this is going to be give the deal right <laughs> give give coupon so great great you can just click this link to get the coupon <clears throat> or uh to 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 get this deal this deal or enter the coupon super 75 off I'm just going to call it that and that's going to be the coupon and we're going to put a link click this link right we're going to do that but first let's just let's just save it okay so we need a coupon actually we need a deal so we need to add a coupon to the course so how do we do that so in the course uh over here we're going to edit the course oh actually no we're not going to edit the course we're going to click on manage deals and coupons so over here I'm going to put a new coupon which is going to be super 75 off and it's going to be 75 it's not going to be a, a special price it's going to be 75 percent off <clears throat> I'm going to just submit that now I have a coupon that's 75 percent off which would be 124 and and oh right sorry and if I just take this I copy this link right here I can go back to the course to the uh, over here and I can add this as the link click this link so I'm just going to click here I'm going to put that as a link that's what that's going to be and then it's going to be like this and save it and there we go okay so now we have an on exit bot I'm going to launch it the thing is that you the on exit bot isn't configured in 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 the course site it's configured in the default bot so now we have the default bot I'll actually let's fix the design here I want the um or the bot design to that that doesn't really matter I just want the uh, bot icon after load I want this to be my same image uh gallery be this one and then save it and launch it okay so now we have the exit bot so now what I got to do is I got to go back to my bots <coughs> into that folder that we just have here so this default one I got to give it the exit as its um as it's on exit so I'm going the settings here of the default and what I do now is I add the other one as the on exit so down here there's an on exit extreme features bot on exit hover so there's I want this to be select template for exit bot it's not default it's going to be default exit right uh display exit button on specific pages no where that's fine I don't need that hide exit bot that's fine okay delayed bot exit exit bot auto open one time only I keep forgetting what all these different things are I guess they're automatic open your exit chat bot when your visitor lands on the page oh okay so that could be but anyways I'm just going to save that and I'm going to launch it so now if I go back to the course page <coughs> and I reload it now you see down the bottom I have the uh, person the LinkedIn question right there right and if I try to exit the page it's going to pop up this new wait 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 don't just go don't you want this course is it the price of the course that's stopping from getting I want it but it's too much I already have it so depending on what they click on if I click on this I want it but it's too much wow yes please what if I gave it to you at 75 percent off and they're going to say wow yes please or they just leave right so I don't have to I could I could make it a bigger conversation where they can say no and then maybe uh, maybe I keep I ask their email and add them to my list or things like that too right you can do all sorts of different things but the idea here is now we have the default bot for somebody visiting the site that's and then we have the on exit bot if they if they're trying to leave the page without you know buying the course right next we want a student bot so now the next thing is the student bot so now we just go back to the bots 
and then we go into here uh, let's go back to well actually just just build a bot uh create the folder it's going to be the same bot we're going to call this uh, LinkedIn student so I guess I have to put this in there because otherwise it's uh when I look at the list right it shows me all the bots so okay so over here I'm going to say so now this is for somebody who already has the course that's going to show up if they already a student of the course so if I go here it should say welcome right <coughs> uh, thanks thanks for purchasing purchasing this course and then we're just going to say did you whoops what can I help you with today right <clears throat> so then I'm going to just put user response here I'm going to say buttons I'm going to say um, uh, contact contact teacher uh, let's just say whoops plus I want to say I don't know um, technical problem technical problem um oops plus uh feature uh can't can't find how to watch course right I don't know whatever right you can have and whatever the conversation could be about the course for for a student that's actually there you just basically build something based on that and then and then uh whoops close that and then I want to launch it and and then uh okay so let's go to the uh, settings now or the design actually I should go to the design go to the des go to the design go to the bot design I also want it to be on the left I want the um the the person to be me <coughs> it's and now uh, the the one that is the oh sorry this one here and the preload one is going to be the one with my little my hand pointing to the side right there and I'm going to save that so that's going to be for a student so basically you have another bot for a student what we do is we go to publish and we get the bot id right here right and inside of the course I go back to the course I edit the course I go back to the header code section the header code section and then I put a student conversion bot id right there so now I have two bots I could create an on exit bot for the student as well but you know probably don't need that right so just a regular bot I'm going to say done right here now I'm not gonna well I guess I could I could get a student in this course and show you what it <coughs> what it looks like uh whenever somebody uh, becomes a student in here but I'm not going to bother with that right now but yeah so once you're once a student buys the course then they would get that particular chatbot instead of the other one where, where maybe you guide them through some of the courses you ask them have you completed lesson number one have you completed lesson number three which lesson are you on you ask them questions and you guide them based on what they answer and things like that right so I've done only I haven't started the course yet or I've started the course or you know whatever whatever you can come up with but you can implement that using this using the my conversion bot the clicky course site and hosting your course on there and adding the bot this way so it's that's it that's how you do it that's how you add a chat bot with a coupon that you give to people who are trying to exit your page to try to sweeten the deal and get them to buy your course all right hopefully you enjoyed if you have any questions feel free to reach out send put a comment below let me know ask and send me an email comment connect with me any of that is great and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time